30 top amazing camouflaged animals in nature. While some animals are so dangerous that they don't require hiding their presence, others rely on deception and camouflage to prevent themselves from meeting a fateful end of the hands of one of their predators. See if you can spot any of these 30 incredible camouflaged animals hiding out in their natural habitats. One, south. This creature isn't the agent of an alien invasion. It's actually known as a south. A south is a planktonic tunicate, an invertebrate that moves through the ocean by funneling water through its jelly-like body. Their translucent body is believed to be a form of defensive camouflage. While they are quite apparent to us, they are much harder for hungry sea creatures to spot. But the most fascinating thing about them is their unique life cycle. Salps cling together to form long chains. As one massive, aggregate organism, they move, feed, mate, and grow as one. <laughs> 2. The Stone Flounder As a type of flatfish, flounder are ideally suited to life on the ocean floor. They huddle up to the seabed, often aided by speckled skin that helps them blend in, such as this pebble-dwelling flounder. That offers safety from predators, but also lets them ambush prey like shrimp, worms and fish larvae. Harmigan. The willow ptarmigan is distinguished by its use of camouflage as protection against predators, changing its plumage from light brown in summer to snow white in winter. Another distinctive feature, its feathered feet, helps a sedentary bird negotiate the frozen ground. <laughs> 4. Great Poto As patus are nocturnal and well camouflaged with their elongated bodies and mottled feathers. It is very difficult to find them except by accident when sitting motionless on a habitual perch during the day.
More often this species is heard rather than seen. All potus are large birds with long tails and large, rounded heads. Of this group, the great poto is the largest, and is the palest in coloration, usually with whitish plumage. Five dot bad face toad. <laughs> A bat faced toad hides among dead leaves, making them very effective predators, especially with their camouflage skills. What makes it even more special is the bat face feature, even improved with color that resembles the dark night quite closely. Six dot common bear and caterpillar. Commonly found in India and Southeast Asia. These caterpillars often blend into the mango plants and shashu plants on which they make their homes. They are considered quite a big headache to local farmers. Bear and caterpillars evolve their elaborate shapes and colors for that single purpose, hiding from predators. Seven dot mossy leaf tailed gecko. Native to Madagascar. This gecko can not only change color to match its surrounding but it also has several dermal flaps that extend outwards to break up its outline. The leaf-tailed gecko has mastered its disguise within the leaves. When in the presence of predators, the gecko is even able to flatten its body against a tree to hide its shadow, becoming virtually invisible. Eight dot dead leaf butterfly. <laughs> dead leaf butterfly are found throughout the tropical Asia. The dead leaf butterfly resembles a dry leaf with dark veins when its wings are closed.
Nine dot stonefish. Stonefish are the most venomous fish on earth. Stonefish blend in with a variety of reefs and rocks, hence their name, and hide on the sea floor, waiting to ambush prey. But as a defense, they also have 13 sharp dorsal spines packed with a potent neurotoxin, which reportedly can kill a human within two hours. <coughs> to avoid stepping on one, experts recommend swimming instead of walking in the ocean. If you must walk, shuffle your feet instead of taking big steps. <coughs> Tin dot great gray owl. <laughs> great gray owl is the world's largest species of owl by length. The great gray owl has no problem concealing itself, especially in the cold northern regions it typically inhabits. Great gray owls are covered in thick gray feathers, which is very handy in the wild, as the gray coloring is fantastic camouflage. It easily helps them blend into the background at night when they're hunting food. Great Grey Owl have big round faces and bright yellow staring eyes. Eleven dot the southern rock agamil lizard. <laughs> Found mostly in South Africa. Southern rock agamil lizard species of lizard is known for its ability to blend into the surrounding rocks. They are able to rapidly change color in a matter of seconds or minutes to better match their background environment and avoid being spotted by approaching predators. lives in small colonies on the rocky outcrops, and the males are very conspicuous for their bright blue heads. <laughs> 12. Leafy Sea Dragon Closely related to seahorses the leafy sea dragon can be found up and down the coast of Australia. <coughs> leafy sea dragon is well known for the long leaf-like protrusions it uses for camouflage.
Sea dragons are some of the most ornately camouflaged creatures on the planet. Adorned with gossamer, leaf-shaped appendages over their entire bodies, they are perfectly outfitted to blend in with the seaweed and kelp formations they live amongst. Leafies are generally brown to yellow in body color with spectacular olive-tinted appendages. Thirteen doubt take me seahorse. <laughs> Coral reefs are rough places to live, so their residents often use camouflage to stay safe. <laughs> And when it comes to living incognito among coral, the pygmy seahorse wrote the book. Less than an inch long and studded with coral-like tubercles, this seahorse has all its evolutionary chips on just two species of gorgonian corals in the Pacific Ocean, with a matching color pattern for each. <laughs> It blends in so well, though, that it was only discovered by humans after showing up with wild caught corals in an aquarium. Fourteen dot right eye flounder. They are called right eye flounders because most species lie on the sea bottom on their left sides, with both eyes on their right sides. One eye migrates to the other side of the body through a metamorphosis as it grows from larval to juvenile stage. Fifteen dot orchid mantis. Thriving in the humid and warm Indonesian rainforests. <laughs> This mantis can usually be found on papaya trees and will pretty much eat anything it catches. Sixteen dot Egyptian night jar. Usually flying at night, the night jar usually lies concealed in the dirt during the day. The adult is sand colors, barred and streaked with buff and brown. The underparts are sandy or whitish.
17 dot cuttlefish. Despite the name, this isn't really a fish. It's a mollusk, and a very well hidden one of that. Besides their insane camouflage skills they are also considered to be one of the most intelligent invertebrates with a very high brain to body mass ratio. Every square millimeter holds up to 200 color changing chromatophores, layered atop other cells that reflect light. <laughs> Cuttlefish also have tiny muscles that can mimic the texture of rocks and reefs, like this broad club cuttlefish. Cuttlefish aren't really fish, they're cephalopods, a family of aquatic mollusks that also includes octopus and squid. Their appearance altering skills go beyond mere camouflage, too, letting them glow wildly with color and light. Eighteen dot Katie did. <laughs> Their leaf like bodies help them evade countless birds, frogs, snakes, and other predators around the world. Katydids are typically not seen but heard, rubbing their wings together to make the namesake Katydid sound. Unlike their cricket relatives, however, Katydids produce egalitarian music, with both males and females chiming in. Some prey on smaller insects, but their favorite food, foliage, is obvious from their appearance. Nineteen dot leopard. <laughs> The spotted pattern of leopards helps camouflage them in several ways. The pattern of dark and light helps break up their visual outline, so they don't stand out so glaringly against the background. Threatened by habitat loss, this unique and difficult to spot frog species is endemic to Madagascar. Twenty one dot novelly crab spider. Oh, my God. 
Living on the east coast of Australia, the shy spider is very hard to spot unless it is moving. Usually however, if you do manage to spot one, it will be resting among tree bark. Twenty two dot horn brock dweller dragonfly. <laughs> the species of dragonfly doesn't play any games when it comes to blending it. Twenty three dot Indonesian mimic octopus. Not only does this species of octopus change its colors to mimic other animals, it actually imitates them as well. In fact, it has been known to copy everything from sea snakes to jellyfish. Twenty four dot wolf spider. These agile hunters will camouflage themselves against their surroundings and then wait patiently for their unfortunate victims. <laughs> Wolf spider are robust and agile hunters with excellent eyesight. Wolf spider live mostly in solitude and hunt alone, and do not spin webs. Twenty five dot ghost mantis. Making its home in Africa and Madagascar, the ghost mantis operates in a very similar manner to the wolf spider, waiting patiently for its prey to stumble across its path. Twenty six dot Arctic fox. Arctic fox may seem bland at first glance, but an arctic fox is ghostly, almost blue coat is ideal attire on the tundra. Arctic fox disappear in snow and defy temperatures as low as 58 below zero. Arctic fox also changes colors for summer, letting the fox hide among rocks and plants. Arctic foxes mostly hunt birds, rodents and fish, but even their fur can't always help them find food in the dead of winter.
28 chameleon. Few animals are as famous for camouflaging as chameleons, whose color changing skills have made them icons of adaptability. But that probably wasn't the reason they evolved the ability, instead, scientists think they mainly change colors to communicate. Certain hues signal certain moods, some advertise anger, others mean I'm ready to mate. While this color code may be why chameleons evolved shifty skin, many have clearly seen its value as camo, too. <laughs> Some even target specific predators, one species in South Africa blends in with the ground to avoid birds, but blends in with the sky to avoid snakes. The key is the chromatophore, a type of pigmented cell layered underneath chameleon's transparent outer skin. Twenty nine dot stick insect. While most animals need a specific backdrop for their camouflage to work, a few are so well disguised they're incognito almost anywhere. Stick insects are a good example, with twig-like bodies that let them become virtually invisible just by holding still. A wide variety of stick insects exist around the world, ranging in size from half an inch to two feet long. Often colored brown or green, they tend to freeze when threatened, sometimes swaying to mimic a branch blowing in the wind. If you like this video, please share with your friends, and don't forget to click the subscribe button.